What's going on, everybody? Exciting video here. We are going to be tackling a level 195 Capricorn Bullhead. So this is the first I've seen him in action. Uh, these are two guildmates who've attacked Fred, the number one player on iOS, by more than 700 cups as it currently stands. Um, so here we go. Um, so we see that his landslide is just uh, getting the crap beat out of it, essentially, by his whole team, which is part of his strategy. He definitely is going to be using Renee Ben, I'm imagining, as we'll see here in a sec. Let's see. All right, he drops his whole team. Landslide comes over, and now, um, and now we go, wow, his landslide. Well, it died, but it came back to life, of course. So here we go. Um, he's obviously using Abyss Demon, Great Sage. Uh, I'm not sure who else. Oh, Toxic Shaman. That's definitely going to be really key to limit the healing. Um, there's that divine that looks so cool that these heroes receive because it's just ridiculous the amount of healing that um, that goes on whenever you use a Berserker Aid and an Enchantress Aid. And I'll have a video coming out on that hopefully sometime soon. So here we go. Um, we see his Abyss Demons helping keep him up a bit. It's taking forever, though, to get through these heroes. That bullhead's just bulldoze in a way um and i it's a little hard to tell what's going on but let's see wow he's killing them that's this is a very impressive attack it's 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 a direct attack it looks like he finally got that bullhead down um definitely seems pretty tanky i know his divine restores his health to 100 percent um and i'd have to check and see what his skill does just to see but it looks like um he's gonna push through this. I don't know. He, he might run out of time at this point. We'll see. He has all of his heroes, though. Um, so that definitely bodes pretty well. And two Thunderblades, so that's pretty good. The Ambrosia's dead. Okay. Looking pretty. It's going to come down to the wire time-wise, but I just want to show you a direct attack. Very, very, very few players do a direct attack, and to do one on someone with these crazy heroes is just insane. So there you have it. Uh, that's 100%. Looks like it took him the full three minutes. In the last second, he did it, and the bullhead was pretty tanky. Um, let's look at, uh, let's see, let's go ahead and fly over to Fred's base. So um, here he is. He's level 195, full glory. Ha doesn't have him evolved to Aquarius yet. Um, let's see. It, it, re it reduces the enemy attack rate by 50%. So that also lowers you're healing quite a bit, plus it does an AoE ticking damage. So that's going to be pretty tough to get through that. Um, thankfully for him, the giant axe went away from his heroes. I think if it would have went towards his heroes, it would have been devastating. Uh, but thankfully it did not. So, um, there you have it. Um, I don't know why I just clicked on the gold mine. But, um, yeah, great player um, from my guild. His name is, uh, I probably say it wrong, Ramahi, right there. Um... You can kind of see, I can't inspect his Landslide or Abyss Demon. I really wanted to, that's why I went to his base. But, you know, very solid player. Um, let's go ahead and switch over to a different kind of attack, a Mercenary attack. So here's Alex, another player in my guild. He uh, uses Mercenaries. You'll see on the left is Saphrix. On the top is, uh, looks like he has Skull Mage, Ambrosia, and Hydrosaur. So he's using the wonton to tank, and it looks like he's going to be able to just take it out. Um, I don't know. Uh, sorry I sped it up there if you wanted to see that. The, uh, the other recording I made um, was lagging quite a bit. So anyways, um, there you have it. Uh, I'm not sure if the mercenary attack will be slowed down enough as he gets it to Aquarius. That's a decent decent increase in how much it slows him down. I'd love to see some more attacks when it's at Aquarius, but for now, it seems like the verdict is in, and Bullhead um, doesn't slow down the mercenary attack less than Aquarius. So the verdict is still out for Aquarius, and we'll see. Uh, hopefully I can get an update here um, in, I don't know, a few weeks. Whenever Fred, whenever you get around to evolving into Aquarius, we'll try and make some more videos. So uh, good luck to you guys, and hope you liked it.